A brother came to campus in 1975, and I remember sitting out somewhere here in the quad area where we used to have graduations, and uh, and brother comes by, uh, this energetic kind of Latino guy, just full of energy, and and came and introduced himself. The Latino leader here at St. Mary's College who raised many of us from young uh, adolescents to mature adults who went on to try to do good in the world the way he taught us here. He taught us how to meditate. He would take us on retreats and we would spend the weekend getting to know ourselves and for the first time being able to take down the, the, the stairs and the shields of adolescence and be able to really take on hard questions of adulthood. And for many of us, those retreats were uh, the first time that we actually could dream about who we were going to become. Hmm. You know, none of us had ever thought about being doctors or lawyers or anything else like that. You know, I recall having an image of, uh, in a dream state while I was there of uh, defending Christians uh, in Roman times. I would later become a lawyer that did criminal defense work and represented people that were facing death and facing very harsh sentences, right? And I've, I always went back to people said, well, how did you become that? I kind of knew at 19 that somehow I was going to get there. He's been my spiritual mentor since I was just a pup. Since 1975 is when I first met him. We opened a school in 19, 1989 in Oakland to serve inner city kids. And we had Brother B, one of our board members. So he guided us through all of that and made sure that we stayed true to our St. Mary's philosophy, you know, and he checked on that a lot. and. The, the, you know, what the teachings were of, of De La Salle. You know, he made sure that we were true to that, and we were because of him. Oh, I'm emotional. Um, it's just to thank Brother for um, just being here for us for 45 years. I mean, we've been in touch for 45 years. He was just always there. He was our solid rock no matter what was going on in our lives. I always try to think about 45 he years here, how many students' lives did he touch and that he may not even know. On behalf of the St. Mary's Alumni Association, it is my pleasure to award the Golden Gale Award to Brother Camillus Chavez. Congratulations, brother. We love you.